All right, everybody, welcome back to another Buzz With Your Cuz. We are out in the rain. Why? We are going to P.F. Chang's to go. We reported when they first identified this location and began the process to open ground. And now we are here to place our order in the Hamlin section of Winter Garden. Let's hit this QR code. Let's pick up some great food and let's see what we got. All right, so we have some key learnings already. You'll notice I have no food. Uh, when you order online, it's the only way to order now. You can't just walk in and order. Your name goes in the system with your order. They don't text you, they don't email, they just give you a time to return. You are hoping that when you return, your order is actually ready. Ours was not. They do have some tables inside um, if we walked in there, you'd see that they're all occupied with other people, just like us, waiting for our food still. So hopefully uh, the kitchen will be able to catch up. We do know that this is a newer business and they'll work the kinks out. But until then, uh, we'll be waiting right here and we hope to have some food here shortly. So we're finally back. We got our food, took about an hour and a half from order to pick up, um, which was slightly over. It looked really super busy. We did indicate that um, while we were waiting outside. Again, they do not have a system to call you back. So you have to take their time, uh, their word on their time, and you show up and hopefully your food is ready. Ours was not, and many others were not today, but uh, management and the service Tried to make up for it, which was really, really nice. Um, spicy chicken, um, mine was a little bit salty. You could tell that they kind of rushed these things together. We got our food actually after they closed, which was uh, a, a whole other thing. Uh, fried rice, a little bland, you know, maybe p potentially overcooked, so it was a little soft. Um, I know I'm being a little bit critical now, but with the weight and the price we paid, we expected a little bit more. Um, we are willing to give them another shot because we do realize that it's a new restaurant and there are a lot of hungry people in Hamlin, right? They are all there. There is a ton of folks trying to order and um, we definitely sympathize with the restaurants. We're not holding this against them, but we did want to be honest with you about our food experience. They did give us some very nice chopsticks. We got low sodium soy sauce, which is pretty funny because my food was super salty anyway. Um, these are the pot stickers. These were really weird. I did not like these at all. Uh, they just didn't hit the expectation of what a pot sticker was. We showed you this a little bit earlier, but this is the honey shrimp. It's in some sort of weird uh, rice paper stuff that kind of sticks to the food. It just made it very unpleasant to eat. And this is a double shrimp order. Uh, would not do that again. So, Apparently, uh, it's a bad luck to eat without a fortune cookie. So they did supply some fortune cookies. Let's open it up and see what it says. This is what you've all been waiting for. What does this fortune cookie say? And now we're going to expose what this fortune cookie has told us. And this is very applicable. It says, and I quote, there is someone owing so many thanks to you. It could be all of you thanking me. It could be the restaurant thanking me. It could be me thanking me. I'm not exactly sure, but I know that this fits. And they're also trying to teach me Chinese on the back. Potato, the word is potato. Ma uh, Ling Shu, everybody. 
and some lucky numbers, which I'll not expose. And if I do hit the lottery on these lucky numbers, don't show those, um, you'll be the first to know about it. Because that is your buzz with your cuz, and we look forward to filling our bellies again soon. Yeah.